Hey, hey everybody, this is Larry. This is me going with Q1 of the weekly contest 270, finding three-digit even numbers. So this one could potentially be bad. Um, there are a couple of ways you can do it, um, but the way that I choose to do it is noticing that there are at most 100 digits. So it's easy to just do n cube one for each digit and just do a for loop. Um, that's basically what I did. Um, and just to check that it, it doesn't have a leading zero, we just check the first digit is not zero. And as long as that's not zero, that's fine. And then the last one is just making sure that the digits um, is even, the last digit is even, and then that's it. Um, you could actually pre-filter it a little bit just to make it a lot more faster, to be honest, so that you kind of, um, you know, don't have to do that. But it's not really a bit, uh, at least for me, it didn't turn out to be a big deal. I didn't know, I actually don't know if you have to sort it. Okay, you do have to sort it. I remember seeing it, but I actually did this without thinking about it. Um, but yeah, this is going to be n cube because, you know, there's three loops and it could be in any order. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. And you can also use uh, Horner's or you can actually pre-cache this and then just add the last digit or something like that. Um, but it doesn't really matter. Um, and you just have to make sure that this is a set. So, because it's the unique integers, right? So yes, yeah, so all that combined, that's pretty much it. The, the space complexity, I, I also sort the digits, but that actually is not necessary. Um, or at least if I sort the digits, I, I don't have to sort this, I think, but I just kind of sort everything because it doesn't matter, right? Um, but yeah, um, the, the space is going to be O of K, where K is the size of the output, because we really don't use any extra space other than the output. So... Um, so yeah, and actually, like I said, if you sort the digits, that, uh, which is n, then you do not have to sort this. So you can say, uh, yeah. Um, the complexity is a little bit rough. I definitely have some hand wavy on the complexity on this one, to be frank. Um, so let's just say that this is my contest code, right, to be clear. And in contest, I just want to get it out as soon as possible. Um, so you can definitely do a little bit better in terms of complexity, but this is my ace. This is my live solving one, right? Like I'm not trying to clean it up for you. I mean, I could, but this is just like, you know, this is what someone who gets it done gets, right? And I did this in two minutes and 30 seconds, um, which is, you know, pretty up there. Like, I don't know if I see anyone better than me. Ooh, ah, they curse, of course. No, no, we tied, we tied, ah. Okay, but nonetheless, you, you get my point. I, I, um, I, I did. I, you know, this was way done very quickly. But yeah. Anyway, you could watch me solve this during the live, live during the contest. Next. Oh come on. Okay, there we go. Okay. It doesn't really matter, but have to be three digits exactly. Okay. I have to sort it. Maybe we don't have to, but it's fine either way. Uh, I'm returning way too many things. Oh, I have to do... Oh, even numbers. Okay. Whoops. Uh, okay, that looks roughly right. But I don't want to get a penalty on something silly. 
Yeah, it looks okay. Let's give it some. Why is this taking so long? If I get a time limit exceeded, that'll be really sad, actually. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. Hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button. Join me on Discord. Uh, thanks for your support. But yeah, come to Discord if y'all want to chat about these problems in a more interactive way. I'm actually been becoming a big fan of Discord, so come man. Yeah, there are a lot of smart people there now. Um, but yeah, stay good, stay healthy, keep grinding. It's tough, I know. Keep going. I believe in you. Um, but yeah, stay healthy. What else does that? To good mental health. I'll see you later and take care. Bye bye.